Welcome to Synagogues of Minnesota, Part 3. In this episode, we take a look at the final bunch of Jewish houses of worship in the state of Minnesota. Our first stop takes us to St. Paul. It is the eastern half of the Twin Cities as it is paired with Minneapolis. There are about 295,000 residents in this city. The first that we're checking out is Mount Zion Temple, a Reformed congregation. Adam Stock Spilker is its rabbi, and Esther Adler is the assistant rabbi. It claims to have been around for at least 150 years, and the current sanctuary was built around 1953. Shabbat services are held both Friday evenings and Saturday mornings, and the formats and times vary from week to week. And here's Temple of Aaron, a conservative-affiliated congregation. Jeremy Fine is the rabbi, and he is assisted by Avi Strasberg. Shabbat services are held both Friday evenings and Saturday mornings. On Sundays, there is a morning minion, and on Monday through Thursday, there is a evening minion only. The congregation was founded in 1910. Portions of the building shown here was reconstructed in the early 1990s. There is a strong Lubavitch presence in St. Paul. We believe this is the home to the Lubavitch Cheder Day School. Its director is Rabbi Shlomo Bendet. The principal is Rabbi Yisrael Goldberg. There is also a Lubavitch Yeshiva, Minnesota-based Naftoli Asor. Its address is linked to the building shown here. And there is also a Beis Chana, which is a Lubavitch Shtibel minion in someone's residence. But let's move back to Congregation Beis Yisrael, an Orthodox shul. It's in the St. Louis Park neighborhood of Minneapolis. Its rabbi, or Mora Diasra, is Yecheskel Tzvi Greenberg. Besides a full slate of daily services, both mornings, afternoons, and evenings, it is a black hat style of shul that is associated with the local kolel and offers various classes in learning. Our final stop is also in St. Louis Park, and it's called Congregation Darche Noam. It is a modern Orthodox synagogue. It was established in 2005, and its spiritual leader is Rabbi Max Davis. Besides Shabbat services, it currently only has a daily morning and evening marv minion. In other words, there is no mincha minion except on Sundays. This concludes our look at synagogues in the state of Minnesota, but there are still other synagogues to be checked out in other parts of the country. So bye for now and see you real soon.